Good morning. My name is Howard Bask. I'm up from Kansas City, and uh, I've got a theoretical value question for you. Uh, if you uh, were to buy a business and you bought it at its intrinsic value, what's the minimum after-tax free cash flow yield you'd need to get? Well, the, um, uh, your question is if we were buying all of a business and we were buying it at what we thought was intrinsic value, what was the minimum? Correct. Present earning power or what the, pres the, the minimum discount rate of future streams? No, what's the uh, minimum current after-tax uh, free cash flow yield you need to get? We, we could conceivably buy a business. I don't think we, 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 we would be likely to, but we could, we could conceivably buy a business that had no current after-tax uh, cash flow, but we would have to think it was, had a, a tremendous future. But the, we would not find, obviously, the, the, the current figures, particularly in the kind of businesses we buy, tend to be representative, we think, of what's ha going to happen in the future. But, but that would not necessarily have to be the case. Uh, uh, you can argue, <clears throat> for example, in buying stock at a time when it uh, was losing significant money. Uh, uh, we didn't expect it to continue to lose significant money. But, but if, we think, if we think the present value of the future earning power is attractive enough compared to the purchase price, we would not we would not be, we would not be uh, overwhelmed by what the first year's figure would be. Uh, Charlie, you want to add to that? Yeah, well, we don't care what we report in the first year or two of uh, after buying anything. Well, I would say that that. Um, in a world of 7% long-term bond rates that uh, we would certainly want to think we were discounting future after-tax streams of cash at, at, at at least a 10% rate. But that, that will depend on, on the certainty we feel about the business. The more certain that we feel about a business, uh, the closer we are willing to play it. We have to feel pretty certain about any business before we're even interested at all. But there, there's still degrees of, of certainty. And, and uh, uh, if we thought we were getting a, a stream of, of cash over the next 30 years that we felt extremely certain about, we would, we would, we would use a discount rate that would be somewhat, what, somewhat less than if, if it was one where we thought we might get some surprises in five or 10 years if a possibility existed. Charlie? Nothing to add. Okay.